variables in Postman. Now remember earlier we used the URL and fetched the box, but it is hectic to type that URL again and again and it's repetitive. So we should not be doing that. Instead, we can use variables in Postman. Variables allows you to save a value and retrieve it later on. You can do it programmatically or you can do it manually. For now, we will go ahead and manually set a variable. And then in the future, we will do the same thing via a program and a script. Let's go ahead and execute that in Postman. Now, if you go to Postman, here you can see this is the URL. Now from M till the edge, we will select the URL and hover over it, you will see this set as variable option. Click on that and it will prompt a new window. Here you can see set as new variable option. Click on that and it will ask you the name of the variable. Remember, the name is case sensitive for our case. So make sure you type exactly as provided in Academy. That is base U capital RL. Now comes scope. Scope basically means where this variable will be available. For our use case, we are going to select collection level variable. You can also see vault, which is where it will be kind of residing on your machine. And then global, which basically means it will be accessible everywhere else. So let's go ahead and select collection. Hit set variable and our variable is set. Now, if you hover over the name of the variable, you can actually see the URL, which we set, right? Make sure you are saving this request before we move further. If you send this request, it will work exactly like before. Nothing actually changes, but we have a new variable name called as base URL. What if you did a mistake or you want to see where this variable exactly resides? Let's go ahead and see that. In Postman, you can click Postman library API v2, which is the name of the collection, and then go to the variables tab. And here you can see the initial and the current value, which we set earlier. We can feel free to change that, you know, not uh, right now, but later on, if you made a mistake, you can change it right here and hit save to update it across the collection. Awesome. 